seem conceited That's good, I got the proof Expansion tour King yo and I left the road defeated Build the bonds while building my credit Excited for this decade Literature-wise, music-wise, and CBD-wise, and media-wise It is very important for us to go out to London You heard it uh, expansion London, we're in the middle of the talks, and so we're bringing it to you. But yeah, uh, London, I the ex the expanding over there is so important. You know, when you're doing business, independent business, and you're setting up your business, it's important to think about all the steps of business. You know, and expansion is is marketing, it's growth. You know, for the business, and it's like, all right, what is the business? And, that's what we've been doing, yeah. you know, on new levels of clarity, writing everything down. If you guys are doing your own businesses, I'd, I'd love to hear how people do their businesses. Me, I'm meticulous. I like to create documents. I like to create folders. I like to write things down, plan, strategize, have multiple plans, have multiple category, categories, identify all the moving parts, understand why things work, why I need to do stuff, what's going on, who are the customers, who are the prospective customers. How much products do I have? What are the prices for my products? The more you can display and dive into the, all the different parts of your universe, which really just starts with what do you make? You know, as an artist, um, is so as a as a person, what do you make? What do you do? What are you interested in? What what's the stuff that you produce? And then from there into the media and then everything else. And so. Um, and the upfronts, the vending, the meeting the people. Exactly. Travel is never not gonna be important. You can do whatever you want inside your house. And I think that's very cool. But the other level on top of that, which is hitting the streets, hitting human beings in your own community and then other communities. Exactly, and it's the OG and tried and true way of you know expansion. The thing is that, you know, sometimes, you know, at the end of the day, you got work to do. You know, and I and like I was telling Kenya, it's just like as an entrepreneur, sometimes you have to, you literally have to set certain goals for yourself, whether that be, so I'm going to put it out there. So some of my goals are to have a book be a New York Times bestseller, to be on the top pre-roll list of, you know, cannabis pre-rolls, and to have my music in a popular anime. And so that's just as far as with those. And then when it comes to the expansion, I realized that it was just as simple as being like, we want to go here. And we did that with Japan. We was literally like before even having to take, didn't even know how it was going to happen. Literally set the month. That was what was crazy. Yeah. Before even getting the tickets or anything, we set the month and we was just all like Japan had no idea how how it was going to even go down you know but now since we've gone through that now and with everything that's been going on globally being able to show people a safe way and plan out and be like okay cool because for both of us individually there's a lot of europe uh energy so for me i've i've gone through my ancestry dna and so you know, I've gone to Mexico and I'm like 3% as far as like um, from that area, as far as my DNA. And so in Europe though, it's like a cool, I'm like a cool 20%. And so there was such an amazing connection with that 3% in Mexico. I can't even imagine what that's going to be in Europe or even in Africa. But us being able to say, like, for example, we both have books, you know, and we both have connections as far as with literary people in that, you know, plus he's already been out there, you know. Time number three. I'm you so know, excited. and so for me, I have a, a guy in London, shout out to Maxim Northover. He did my claymation video. He's out there. I have one minute book review who did my book review for Ideas of Illusion who was out there. I have a producer, Monkey, out in Germany. He's been like, I mean, it's probably been like a cool decade, you know? And these are people that I've never seen in person. And to be live and direct and go out there, there's so many, 
in the hip hop world, they love American hip hop as well over there. You know, I've heard so many stories of just unknown people going out there and just straight up rocking it. But the thing is, what's weird is I'm not unknown over there because when I look at the analytics, I'm seeing that these are consistent places exactly. where I'm not even targeting those areas. But and that's, I'm naturally and that's my thing. It's like, let's get out there because I think we get so stuck in our own bubbles wherever you are, no matter where it is. And we just forget that this is a very big world. And there's a lot of different people. And yes, those we might be hearing some of the same stuff um, as far as news. But they're living completely different lives with completely different sets of circumstances. And so anytime you get out there, you really understand, okay, yeah. Um, it even helps you think about who's going to be listening to my music in their car and how they're going to be driving, you know? Can I, for even funny stuff, just re really, really remembering that they drive on the other side of the road. Exactly. Throwing in a little... <laughs> A little something for the people who are listening out there. You know, I love mentioning San Antonio in my music. I like mentioning Antelope Valley. I like mentioning Oakland, Berkeley, San Francisco, all my great Tokyo, uh, Nagoya in my music. I love, I love traveling, so I love putting these bits in there. And even with my poems too, I like putting these bits, uh, these little bits of the places that I've been in there. So doing that in one and two. So that you know the books have resonance with those people too, and the way that I do it is gonna be fun. And then also, when it comes to the publication of art and music, exactly. there's so much foundation out there when it comes the to literary commerce. World commerce. Um, also, a lot of my favorite mm -hmm. authors are from freaking Europe, or there's like a lot of like you know German philosophers and, and stuff that. You know, I, we were talking about campaigns. One of my big campaigns right now is with my next 100 customers. Why? Because it's so much fun not only to be more sustainable as a business and, you know, I got to grow because I want to do more stuff. I want to be able to empower more creative. I want people to who literally just want to make music to be able to just make music and I want to be able to support that in an ecosystem plus other stuff. And, and um, what was I going to say? Oh, what, the 100 customer goals. So and that's also, also fun because that's traveling through the next 100 people who are going to be super duper intimately part of this business. You know, I probably had overall um, in customers probably less than a thousand when I really think about individual customers. And I'm thinking about, well, I don't know, probably not that. But let's say less than 100 customers. When I think about these next 100 uh, less than 100 customers that are contributing more than $50. Because I'm like, I don't know, like ads and little stuff, there's probably been a lot of different people. But really thinking about these next ones, and for Project 4, the business really exactly. too, the next 100, and I'm like, all right, I would love to get two, you know, British creators to join <laughs> Project 4. It's someone yeah. in, in Britain who just loves one of those creators. Maybe they come on to Project 4 just to watch that person and the films that we get to collaborate with, and then and then even setting up everything that Project Forward also does out in London. I'm interested, I have some ideas for, I mean, we're doing delivery out here in San Antonio. I would wanna expand to LA and and uh, then, I don't know, after that, but it's gonna be a whole new mind opener that'll give me tons of information to be like, what about London? Exactly. You know, if Uber's out in London, I wanna, I wanna what's that gonna look like when I'm able to accomplish deliveries? And that's important because I ship the package to someone, someone picks it up, and then they go deliver however it goes down. Or even being able to connect with a, a, a vendor from London and have their products available for delivery in San Antonio and LA. So and there's so much. Like the, uh, in the cannabis world, like yeah. for me, and even with space, so a lot of my big campaign, you know, talk about campaign, so mine is, you know, life isn't black or white, it's the composition. And the thing is that my whole thing right now is cannabis and space. And there's a lot, even when we go into Europe, there's a lot when it comes to space exploration over there. And then there's a lot when it comes to cannabis. So being able to go over there and meet, like literally we can email and message scientists and astronauts and all these people over there and literally schedule a sit down and talk to them the like interviews. some, you know, some like, because we can, like these are legit yeah, record things. the way that we do get some music videos exactly. out there. Woo! With some out there. Oh so my poems. goodness. I create love some, the Create some media. Cause like, yeah, think about London right now. When was the last time you saw 
of something from London. And do you know how? I have a freaking Banksy piece tatted on me. Come on now, like, like I, like I was, I literally thought about that because when you said art, I was like, oh, in the street art, and I was like, oh. My, one of my freaking favorite art, freaking oh. Banksy, you right. know, like hey, they make cool. to do some, some freaking art and like right. other British hip hop too. Exactly, it's going down. It's so gonna be fun. The plan is what we're thinking. End of oh, October, October um, probably get out there. Um, you know, it, it's it's gonna yeah. So that's the idea, and um, yeah, man, we look forward to. It. We want you guys to be a part of it. Um, how can you be a part of it? Um, follow, you know, me, follow Mr. Composition, follow Project 4, follow Daptro. Um Creations will do more tags at the end, but uh, there's also different products that we like to try to drop because we want you to be able to sponsor different things. So I think this time around we want to do some, you can go buy expansion credits if you're a creator. Those, while we help you do services and help you create stuff, that money also goes to, you know, us. So, and then uh, we also want to do um, like sponsorship opportunities. So, for the videos that we're making, if you buy some of the sponsorship credits or whatever we end up calling them, you buy some of these sponsorship stuff, we'll tag you. Have a page definitely that has um, the expansion page on, I can say, Voter. If you go to the voter.project4.tv, definitely. And then maybe one on Dab Troll too, but we'll have a page where we have everyone who buys the different sponsorship products. So if you want to send us any money, you can cash app me, Kenya.org, or you can cash app me at dollar sign Dab Troll Creations with the SFN. Boom, boom, boom. So anything that you cash app, any amount that you send to us, um, it literally you will, will, will get you down. used. We yeah. um, shout out to everyone that donated when it came to expansion Japan. It literally that was so cool. That was it that literally was so cool. helped. It us changed the trip entirely. Because, completely because we finished that on a razor's edge, and it was you know what? By, did we ever do a thing? If not, oh, this is the official thing we because we I really think it about how appreciative. Yeah. Like it's like whoa, yeah. we visibly we'll have some noticed events in. In, in uh, up up until then, mm -hmm. in the states and in, in Texas, um, leading up to the expansion, we're gonna be traveling up until then, and so you'll be able to follow and continue being a part of it. And we thank you for being part of every single bit of anything. You know, just watching this right now. Thank you. You are super duper awesome. Um, and all your likes, shares, comments, and um, subscribes. Those are that's everything. Like uh, you, when you're an independent creator, you know. That's all you can hope for, because it's like, there's one game I like to play called Kingdoms and Castles, and it's like, you build, you build, you build, and then every year a certain number of people come and they visit your kingdom, and like, some of them are like, and then like one of them will be like, I found a place to hang out, and then the rest of them, like, but it's just like, that's what it's like, you know, we, we build, we build, we build, and um, you know, it's always thinking about how can we make a better place for more people to stay, and we thank you for coming through visiting, checking it out, and um, for choosing to stay. It's super awesome. Expand and grow. Expand and grow. Expansion London, coming at you next. Whoop. Makes you seem conceited. That's good, I got the proof. Expansion toy. Kenyo and I left the road defeated. Build the bonds while building my...